After serving two terms as president, George Washington retired from public life. This helped to establish a precedent held into the presidency of Franklin D. Roosevelt that presidents would not serve more than two terms. Thomas Jefferson of the Democratic Republican Party would run to replace Washington with Aaron Burr running as his vice presidential candidate. Opposing him would be Washington's vice president, John Adams of the Federalist Party, with Thomas Pinckney, his vice presidential candidate. Adams received 71 electoral votes and was elected president. Several electors who voted for Adams did not vote for Pinckney with their second choice. So, Jefferson came in second with 68 electoral votes and was elected vice president. The country was divided, however, as Adams won New England, New York, and New Jersey, while Jefferson won Pennsylvania and the southern states.